What about how the United States is using strategic petroleum reserve stockpiles? We've seen President Biden pulling the lever on the SPR. The energy minister in Saudi Arabia says that's a tool of market manipulation. Is the president and the United States using those emergency stockpiles in the right way, in your view? Well, I, I think uh, President Biden is getting very poor advice. Uh, the strategic reserve in the U.S. has had a very important uh, security function for the U.S. and for the rest of the world. And to then just start tapping into it uh, on time to time for commercial reasons, uh, maybe not even very enduring or very helpful, uh, it just undermines that whole security function. This is the same thing we have. We keep spare capacity for security reasons. Uh, we don't squander it, and I'm afraid he's getting very bad advice. So, Sadat, what is the way out of this current situation facing Saudi Arabia and the United States? Do you see a resolution on the horizon anytime soon? Well, I don't think there's a problem. <laughs> uh, we are selling all the oil that is being required. Uh, we're not, Saudi Arabia doesn't, to my knowledge, turn down any client, uh, Far East, uh, North America, anywhere. So I don't see a, actually an issue, uh, a shortage of supply. Uh, as I say, the U.S. Energy Information Administration itself shows an excess. Uh, U.S. drilling has uh, gone flat, oil drilling. Gas supplies in the U.S. have gone negative on price because of too much gas. So there's no shortage of energy. There's no shortage of supplies. I, I think it's really uh, a little bit of a mis misunderstanding.